Welcome to the Steve Ames Show with guitarist Sandy Renda, pianist Mike Yanuzzi, and my special guest, singer-songwriter Brian Gary. And now, on with the show! I'm a sentimental sap, that's all. What's the use of trying not to fall? I have no will. You've made your kill, cause you took advantage of me. I'm just like an apple on a bough, and you're gonna shake me down somehow. What's the use? You've cooked my goose, cause you took advantage of me. I'm so hot and bothered that I don't know my elbow from my ear. I suffer something awful each time you go, and much worse when you're near. Here I am with both my bridges burned, just a babe in arms when you're concerned. So lock the doors and call me yours, cause you took advantage of me. I'm a sentimental sap, that's all. What's the use of trying not to fall? I have no will. You've made your kill, cause you took advantage of me. I'm just like an apple on a bough, and you're gonna shake me down somehow. What's the use? You've cooked my goose, cause you took advantage of me. I'm so hot and bothered that I don't I suffer something awful each time you go, and much worse when you're near. Here I am with all my bridges burned, just a babe in arms when you're concerned. So lock the doors and call me yours, cause you took advantage of me. took advantage of me by Rogers and Hart. And now here are the two mighty musicians at the guitar, Sandy Renda. <laughs> and at the keyboard, Mike Yanuzzi. We're opening our show tonight with songs written by Rogers and Hart. Richard Rogers wrote the music, Lorenz Hart wrote the lyrics. And what great music and lyrics they gave us. Here's a song from the Broadway show, Garrick Gaieties. We'll have Manhattan, the Bronx and Staten Island too. It's lovely going through the It's very fancy on old Delancey Street, you know. The subway charms us so as balmy breezes blow to and fro. And tell me what street compares with Mott Street in July. Sweet push cards gently gliding by. The great big city's a wondrous toy Just made for a girl and boy We'll turn Manhattan into an isle of joy We'll 
turn Manhattan into an isle of joy. Sandy Randa, Mike right, Danuzzi, nice thank you both for helping me celebrate the music of Rogers and Hart. And Mike Danuzzi, I want to congratulate you on the wonderful job you did as an actor and a singer in the play The Music Man. I had the pleasure of going to see the show. My mother came with me with our good friends Walter Plesny oh. and Audrey. Right. And we saw you in Sparta, That's in the right. town of Sparta. And you and the entire cast were terrific. Thank Tell you. the folks more <laughs> about that. Uh, we, uh, it, it's a group called the Salt and Light Theater. And uh, it was a production that uh, it's, it's part, they're part of their ministry, the uh, First Presbyterian Church of Sparta. Uh, the music director there, her name is Karen McKeever, is a friend of mine, and she called me up and said, we're doing Music Man. You know, we're looking for people to come out and audition, and I thought, well, I'm so busy with everything else. But it worked out, and I was able to go, and, uh, and I, I went through a straight audition, and I got the part of Harold Hill. The and lead part, yeah. <laughs> the part that Robert Preston played. That's right, that's right. And uh, which uh, I, I've done this show before. I, I've done almost all the parts before, including singing in the quartet. But it was very special. I actually did their very first and second shows that, that Salt and Light ever did about 14 years ago. And, uh, and it's funny because there were still a lot of connections. The guy who played Charlie Cowell, uh, one of the shows I did with them was uh, It's a Wonderful Life. And he was uh, George Bailey, and I was Mr. Martini in that show. Uh -huh. So that, that's how far back it goes. So uh, it was a, a wonderful experience. Everybody was so great there. Uh, had just a, a wonderful time. We had really nice audiences uh, for that weekend that we did the show. So it was a lot of work, and, and uh, it's done now. And, you know, it was a great – everybody just did great. It was a wonderful and time. And all the music was provided by musical tracks. That's right. That's right. The, the uh, company that licenses the – this particular version of the Music Man provides you with the tracks, and uh, they don't even give you an orchestration anymore, unfortunately, mm. uh, because uh, you know Karen always used to have live music there, but this year we went strictly with the tracks. And later on our show, you will be singing one of the hit songs from the show, That's right. 76 Trombones, yep. written right. by the great Meredith, Meredith Wilson. Wilson. Uh, Sandy Randa, you have a connection with the Music Man because when you were a child actor, Back in the 1950s, you auditioned for the original production on Broadway. Yes, it was so long ago, I don't, <laughs> I, I don't remember all the detail. But I do remember I was up for the part, and what I do remember was between myself and Eddie Hodges. And Eddie Hodges won out. So um, it was for the Broadway. Uh, That's the, right. Uh, so that would have been play. around 1957. Yeah, whatever. That, that would have made me 10 years old. So I don't That's know if it was right. Gleason. It was well, you came close. Yeah, I came very close. Um, for better or for worse, I wasn't uh, uh, into going into New York in and out anyway as the time went by. But it was, it's always an honor to be picked for, uh, for material like that, for shows like that, just for parts that you audition for. So that, that, that part of it's very nice. It's a nice yeah. memory. Yep. And what song do you have for us tonight? Uh, this is a, one of the uh, great instrumentals, I guess, of the 60s. Uh, an artist uh, by the name of Jordan Ingman. He was the first to do this, uh, this particular one from what I know. The song is called Apache, later on uh, covered also by The Ventures. A great, a great instrumental piece. So um, we're going to do Apache. Very good. Let's hear it for <laughs> Sandy and Mike. <laughs> Thank you. 
And now, as promised, here is Mike Yanuzzi singing 76 trombones from Meredith Wilson's The Music Man. Seventy-six trombones led the big parade With a hundred and ten cornets close at hand They were followed by rows and rows Of the finest virtuosos The cream of every favors band Seventy-six trombones caught the morning sun With a hundred and ten cornets right behind There were more than a thousand reeds Springing up like weeds There were horns of every shape and kind there were copper bottom timpani and horse platoons thundering thundering all across the way double bell euphoniums and big bassoons each bassoon having its big fat way there were 50 mounted cannon in the battery thundering thundering louder than before clarinets of every size and trumpeters who'd improvise a full octave higher than the score Seventy-six trombones hit the counterpoint With a hundred and ten cornets blaze away To the rhythm of hutch, hutch, hutch All the kids began to march And they're marching still Right today Marching still right today Brian Gary is a very talented singer and songwriter, and he comes from a very talented family. His grandfather was legendary entertainer Eddie Cantor. And now, here is Brian Gary singing his own songs. <laughs>
that? Oh, okay. <laughs> um, those are from this new album uh, called Jeannie's Album. And uh, there's a good reason why I'm calling it that, because uh, these are songs I've written over the last eight years or so. And uh, even though I'd written a bunch of other songs during that time, uh, I found that there was this common denominator of songs about my wife. So I decided to do this album. And uh, the album cover is uh, a photograph by James Gavin, who wrote a, yeah, some of you may know, uh, one of the great uh, authors. And he wrote a book on Chet Baker that uh, I just worshiped. And uh, so when we decided to do this album, I asked, uh, he's a great photographer too, James. So um, I decided that uh, this album cover is going to be based on a Chet Baker album cover. So this is literally like the album cover of Chet. So if any of you uh, get this album today and then go home and look on the internet, you'll find the album Chet and it's very similar to this. So we had a nice time uh, photographing this. Um, all these songs, as I say, are about uh, some way or another about Jeannie. And uh, this next song is literally the first one I ever wrote that, uh, that concerns her. And um, I'm going to try and do it for you right now. Thanks, Eric. Vincent Yeomans composed the music, and Harold Adamson and Matt Gordon wrote the lyrics to this beautiful love song popularized by the famous radio crooner Russ Colombo. Time. 
time on my hands, you in my arms, nothing but love in view. Then if you'd fall once and for all, I'd find my dreams come true. Moments to spare for someone you care for, one love affair for two. I'm on my hands and you in my arms and love in my heart all for you Moments to spare for someone you care for, one love affair for two. Mm, with time on my hands and you in my arms and love in my heart, all. Well, that's our show for tonight. Let's hear it for the two musicians, Sandy Renda, Mike Yanuzzi, our producer-director, Jerry Schoenthal, and our very special guest, Brian Gary. And until we meet again, remember... Good night, sweetheart, till we meet tomorrow. Good night, sweetheart, sleep will banish sorrow. Tears and parting may make us forlorn, but till the dawn a new day is born. So I'll say good night, sweetheart, though I'm not beside you. Good night, sweetheart, here's my love to guide you. Dreams enfold you, in each one I'll hold you. Good night, sweetheart, good night. Good night.